So, the theme is... The theme is... What the author wants you to learn. What the author wants you to learn. The theme is... The theme is... What the author wants you to learn. What the author wants you to learn. The main idea is what the story is mostly about. Your turn. The main idea is mostly what the story is about. Beautiful. So, remember some of the ideas that we came up with the other day were... Um, some of the themes could be sadness, right? Yeah. In our um, stories or passages that we read. Some of the st uh, other themes could be um, feeling left out, right? When somebody makes you feel kind of not so good inside and you feel left out. But the main idea would be what the text is mostly about, right? So I'm gonna go and I'm gonna read a story, a task card to you. Right now I just want you to listen and we're gonna go, I'm gonna go through this and then we're, you're gonna help me out with one of the task cards, okay? So, Easton was a loyal friend, always kind and always trying to help others. Recently he had started hanging out with three new friends and he was beginning to realize the kind of people they really were. Jackson was always playing practical jokes on other people and thought it was hilarious. One weekend, Easton came up with the best practical joke ever. But when he did it, Jackson stayed mad at him for the rest of the day. Preston loved to make up not so nice names for other people. But when Pre Easton called him Preston the Bestin this weekend, Preston gave him a dirty look, snarling at that it wasn't nice to make up names for people. Then there was Carlton, who was always poking fun at Easton's curly hair, like this little guy. During a trip to the movies, Easton pointed out a curl on Carlton's head. Carlton swatted his hand away, angrily telling him that it was nothing like a mop of curly hair. Suddenly, it dawned on Easton that these new friends couldn't take a dose of their own medicine. Hmm. Not only that, but he didn't like the way that he treat, they treated people. And he didn't want to treat people that way either. It was definitely time for some new friends. These weren't the kind of people that he wanted to be around. So when I'm thinking of main idea and I'm thinking of what's the difference between theme and main idea, I'm thinking, I know the theme is the lesson I need to learn in the story, right? The lesson that the author wants me to learn. So when I look at my three choices, am I thinking that the author wants me to know that I should treat others the way you want to be treated? Jackson loved playing practical jokes but didn't like, uh, like them played on him? Or Easton tried to be like his friends and he realized that his friends didn't like to be treated that way, the way they treated people? I know when I read those three, that this is a lesson. Letter A is yeah. a lesson. A Treat theme. others the way you want to be treated. That would be my theme, okay? Mm -hmm. So, <coughs> I know that this would be, okay. I know A would be my theme. So then I have to look at the other two options. If A is my theme, which one of these, a B or C, would be my main idea. So then I read them to myself again. I say, Jackson loved playing practical jokes, but didn't like them played on him. Or Easton tried to be like his friends, and he realized that his friends didn't like to be treated the way, the way other, they treated other people. I'm thinking, I know that the main idea is what the text is mostly about. It's my turn, right? I just want you to watch. So I'm thinking B is my main idea. The text is mostly about Jackson loving, loving to play practical jokes on others, but then when they wanted to do it to him, he did not like those jokes. So I'm thinking that the B is my main idea. So now, I want you guys to help me out with one. We're going to read one together, and then you're going to help me decide which one is the theme and which one is the main idea, all right? So let's take a look at this one. 
I'm gonna read it orally. Oops. I'm gonna read it orally, and then I want you to go ahead and join me. Okay? Technical difficulties, but that's okay. I'm gonna read it out loud, so you can just listen to the story. Ready? Thank you for, I see all your eyes on me. Amelia and Dante were like Batman and Robin. No matter what Amelia did to make their classroom a happier place, Dante always did something to bring them down and ruin their day. Today was field day and the class was a buzz as they got to ready to walk out of the field. Gathering in line, Dante started arguing with his teacher. But I want to bring my soda outside with me. I don't care what you say. It's going outside whether you like it or not. Mrs. Smith's face burned fiery red, and she told the rest of the class to sit back down. As they headed back to their seats, Dante threw the can of soda at the window. But just before it shattered the glass, Amelia intercepted it. The class froze, waiting to see what Dante would say. As his eyes grew wide, the principal came storming in and removed him from the class. Mrs. Smith breathed a sigh of relief as the rest of the class to the field day. Dante spent his day in detention while the rest of the class basked in the sunny, happy day. So, when we think about um, the theme and main idea. I want you to turn and talk to your partner. And I want you to tell your partner, what do you think the theme of this story might be? Remember, the theme is what the author wants you to learn, okay? Turn and talk. The theme is what the author wants you to learn. The main idea is what the story is mostly about. So what do you think the, the theme is of this story? The, the, theme, is, the theme is good ways. I think it's the good ways. Good always, no, it's not that one. Oh, so that says good always conquers bad. That's what it says. Yeah, that's so what's the you think that's the theme? Uh, yeah. yeah. Conquer, um, really conquer means to win. And so good always wins? Good always yeah. wins over bad. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Amelia caught the soda that... When you're ready to share, yeah, put that's your pinky in the yeah. yeah. All right, I see a lot of pinkies. So, what do you think the theme might be of this short passage? What do you think, Joanna? The theme is let it be good always con what? conquers. Conquers bad. So, I know some, one of my friends over here asked me, what does conquered mean? What does conquered mean, Emily? Uh, conquer means that, uh, that you always win. That, that you win, right? So show me um, two fingers in the air if you believe that good always conquers bad is the theme. Wait, two pinkies? Two fingers. Okay. It can be your pinkies if you want. All right, so I agree with you. I think that is the theme. That's the lesson that we want people to learn. Now, take a look at the last two. Dante argued with the teacher, but Amelia saved the day, or Amelia caught the soda and that Dante threw. Turn and tell your partner, which one do you think is the I main idea? I the the what the story is mostly C. about. The, I think it's C. How about we stand up? If you think the main idea is A, I want you to move to this side of the room. If you think it's C, I want you to come on this side. <coughs> All right, let's take a look. If you are on the A side, tell us why you think A is the main idea. Because mostly what the story was about is that Dante argued with the teacher and the teacher couldn't get the can and then it, um, yeah, yeah, and just then stand up and then got the can. Okay, so so the main the idea is what the story is mostly about, oh, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. So are you saying that you think that um, oh. Dante oh. argued with the teacher, but Amelia saved the day is what the story is mostly about? Yeah. If you say C, tell me or explain to me why you say C is the main idea. Why is C the main idea? Okay, so one at a time. So who's going to share? 
tell me why you think um, C is the main idea. I think C is the main idea because when Don came through the so through the soda, Amelia caught the caught the can. Okay, so the story was about the whole story was about Dante throwing the soda and Amelia catching it. Mm -hmm. What do you think the whole story was about? So, do you want to revise your answer? Yeah. yeah. So, if you want to revise your answer, <laughs> you may revise your answer. <laughs> so, those of you who came over here, why did you revise your answer the way that you did? Wait, Alessandra, you still think like C? <laughs> he might. I guess the whole class is. So my question for you is: those of you who <laughs> revised your answer, what what made you revise your answer? It made me revise my answer because the story was not mostly about yeah. how to um, like how they throwing about sodas all over the place. It was mainly about Daniel arguing with his teacher, but she uh, but. Amelia actually saved the day. So I liked how you said the whole story was not about her throwing the can, but more about her arguing, um, da uh, Dante arguing with his teacher, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead and have a seat. But that was okay, already so already now. That was already. Oh, you're gonna fall. And you can hear me put your hands on your head. I can't. Okay. All right. But if you can hear me, clap your hands two times. All right. So this is what you're going to do. I'm going to give you a couple of scenarios to read with your group. And you are going to come up with the theme and the main idea of the text. Okay? When you get your um, paper, remember you can grab a clipboard. Yeah. What do you, what's the first thing you do? Oh, put your name. You on always put your name. name. But do you just put one name? Group put your name. group's name. Okay. Remember, on one side you're going to put the task card number, mm -hmm. and then I want you to write the main idea and the theme for each passage. Wait. Okay? Who can tell me what we are going to do? Wait, uh, well, do you question. have a question? Okay. Yeah, are we gonna are we gonna be with the same partners or another partner? You're, you're gonna work with your small group, the same ones you worked with the other day. Can I change? Um, I'm going to have you stay with your group for today. Okay. okay. Who can tell me what we are going to do today? Um, Christopher, tell me what we're going to do. Today we're doing the theme and the main idea with your partner and, and uh, you need to get a piece of paper and write your name and write the facts about uh, the theme and the main idea. Okay, who can add on to what Christopher just said? David? <laughs> Anybody else? Maria, what are we doing today? Where that's what we're doing. What I'd like you to do is rock, paper, scissors. Once you get your group, rock, paper, scissors to see who's gonna come and collect the materials. You may get up and move.